Well, Hazy, I know this is one of your favourite TV shows and it returns tonight on 10 and 10 Play, 8.40. It is called Have You Been Paying Attention? It is season 12 and joining us now are the stars of it, Sam Pang and Tom Glasner. Good morning. Hello, Jodie. Hey, Hazy. Good Hi. morning. Mate. You just said, Sam, off air, is this live? And I said, as if we could trust you to go live any more <laughs> than we could trust the guy on Friday who dropped a massive F-bomb during the 6.15 vending machine quiz that we have. Was it you? <laughs> <laughs> was it in context or just a random uh, a random profanity? It was very much in context. So basically the question was, um, who said this from what movie? And it was Sylvester Stallone in Rocky. And he goes, oh, that's um, oh, that's the bloke from Rocky. Oh, is he? Yes. Ah, f- and you can gather the yeah, rest. Bit of thinking, swearing. And so then Andrew yeah. Hayes smashed the dump button hard. And what happened, Andrew? Yeah, nothing happened. You actually hear me hit the dump button <laughs> and then nothing just went straight through to the keeper and we had some fun with it. And now we're on our last warning. It, awesome. I think it's always a good sign when you can actually hear the um, presenters hitting the equipment, hitting yeah. the buttons. That, that's, I think it was like, that should be a secret sound one time. That's <laughs> The secret sound is us getting sacked. Yeah. <laughs> Sam, you've spent many, many years in radio. Have you ever had to use the dump button? Oh, Jody, this may surprise you. I wasn't allowed to touch any of the equipment. Like we had a you know, we had an anchor. Do you two do it yourself? He does it. Hazy does it. Hazy does it. Okay, well, I get it. But no, no, I was just I just sat in front of a microphone and then uh yeah, my seven years at uh, Nova in Melbourne, I I had um a young man called uh, Dino, Dean Thomas, who was um in charge of uh, the equipment, and he had no idea how any of the buttons worked. So I can't believe we went to air, and when we needed a dump button, he would have no idea where it was. So, I, you know, I think you're better situated than we, we are, but that doesn't guarantee anything. I don't know about that at all, because sometimes I look at Hayes' face, and I swear to God, there are just monkey symbols going off in his brain, and he has no idea what he's 100%. Doing. So Joe's knows something's going on with both pupils looking different directions. There's fluid coming out of the ears, nose, and mouth. But, hey, so you've got the right idea in radio. You always need to be multi-skilled. So you were obviously yeah. a presenter and you can do the panelling. So if they had to sack you, they need two people. Oh, 100%. So you're, uh, you're more entrenched. Uh, Jodie, you're on shaky ground. <laughs> 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 um, 12th season, this is just an absolute phenomenon. Are you still having fun? It's an absolute blast to get together with uh, with everyone. Sam and I were just saying how good it was to you know, get back into the studio. It's, it is it really is a bit of a party and um, uh, we get a small audience in. There's about 70 people, some of whom have waited since pre-COVID to get a ticket to yeah. the show. So it's, really? yeah, it's got a, just a really good vibe. You speak for yourself, Tom. Right. It's another gig, just another gig for me. <laughs> it's just a paycheck. It is just an invoice and it is. It, I am contractually obliged to get to be there. That, that it says forward. paycheck, it's cash in hand. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was going to say, that. I was going to say, are you a full time employee, Sam, or are you just like a casual? <laughs> no, very casual. Very, very casual. Yeah, it's still a tax deduction. So that's yeah. amazing. What is it, Sam? Is it like clear it? money in envelope, like country football or something, like money in yeah, envelope I'll, after I'll the show? School. <laughs> <laughs> the handshake in the envelope. I, it's my, I'm well aware of that. No, I wish it was. Geez, that'd be good. That's, it'd be so sweet if at the end of the show you had to hand me a, a brown bag top. I reckon that'd be a way to, what a way to finish the show. Yeah. Um, now you guys mentioned country football here, so you wouldn't be across this, but there is a team in Adelaide, South Australia, um, called the Elizabeth Eagles. And Sam, you'd be all over it. You um, would have mentioned this on the front bar. I'm all over this, and we covered this on front bar. You obviously missed that episode. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you glued to Channel 10. Listen, if Fitzy's not on, then I check it out. I am aware of the story. The mm. 800 and, was it 842? No, it was 512, so 82 goals, I think. Was yeah, 516. 82 goals, that's yeah. right. 500 well, I'll tell you what's going to make the difference. The Cavalry has arrived because four-time premiership player for the Sandful, for the Central Districts, Andrew Hayes, is going to suit up for the Elizabeth Eagles and try and turn the fortunes of their turn season the around. Yeah. Is that right? Mm. Yeah. Oh, I've, my God. I've, when was the last time you played, Hazy? Uh, 2015. <laughs> <laughs> Still in that condition, are we? <laughs> Yeah, so I don't have an arse at the moment as well. That's probably the most concerning thing. I don't know when you, when, what's happened to you blokes because you're both finely tuned athletes, but as I've got older, my arse just has disappeared. And my hamstrings right now are just oh, yeah. rubbery. Yeah. Man, you're two to one to do a hamstring in the warm up. If you get to the first siren, it'll be a miracle. I've been told that as well. Don't do anything different because you might as well do a hamstring in game than before the game if you start training That's a for good it. Point.
Yeah. And you're also a target because every amateur football oh wants God, to I sort know. of have the badge yeah. on and say, I took, you know, yeah. took someone Hazy out. From, you know. out. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, trying to grow some eyes in the back of my head. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. At that. I can't wait. This is big news. I, I, I've got actually something to take to a front bar meeting. That'll be great. <laughs> <laughs> Tom, Tom. Um, any special guests on Have You Been Paying Attention Tonight? No. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about the front bar. Got a no, guest. we have a huge guest. We have um, Scott, Sky Wheatley who uh, who won oh. uh, the uh, the Jungle Show. Yeah, the and Jungle Show. <laughs> and uh, a huge name, and uh, and she's um uh, she's from the Gold Coast. Yeah, and she's coming down to have a bit of a chat about uh, how I can uh, how I can lift my social media uh, numbers because yeah. they're they're sort of plateauing at the moment. Yeah, she's an influencer, by the way, Hazy. Mm. You're looking a little a, bit a mega influencer. Yeah. Mega influencer. influencer. I'm familiar with Sky's work as well. Are you? Absolutely. That's yeah. great. You follow her on what, Instagram? What do you know about what do you know about her, Hazy? Uh, I know that she is a social media influencer. <laughs> 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 Have you been paying attention? Season twelve, back tonight at eight forty. It is hands down one of the best shows on television. Thank you so much for having a chat with us this morning, guys. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Thanks. you. Thanks, Thanks. Thanks. Leave Thanks. the Nova Studio as you found it, Sam. Thank you. Uh, well, I will, I promise. Put it down. <laughs>